Hey guys, it's Tanya from TCB Cards. Thank you so much for joining me. Today I have a paper pumpkin kit. This was actually last month's kit, April 2018, called You Are My Anchor. I'm going to show you how easy it is to put some of these cards together. These are little note cards and you actually in this kit get one, two, three, four, five, five different note cards, and you also get a little box to put them in. Uh, this kit also comes with the decorative envelopes for your note cards, so it's a really, really cute kit and great for summer um, little note cards that you might want to put on a little gift or to give to someone special. I'm gonna show you how to make two of the cards today, just to give you an idea of what it, looks like. I have gone ahead and punched out all the um, die cuts that, that you need. That's one of the first steps to do when you're doing your paper pumpkin kit is just to go ahead and um, get all of those punched out so that they're ready to go. So this, this is the first note card. It comes just like this and all you have to do, it's already scored for you. So you just have to um, fold it over and I like to use my bone folder just to give it that nice crisp edge. So I'm do that. All right, and this is the anchor. It was a die cut, so you don't, didn't even have to stamp that. I went ahead and cut the twine for that and went ahead and tied it on there for you. But um, let me show you one thing. Inside of your instructions, there is actually a ruler. That's how I measured the um, the length that I need and in the directions it actually tells you how long you need the the twine or ribbon whatever the kit might have for each different um, project there so um, so if you do take these with you and do them somewhere where you don't have a ruler just remember that that ruler is there in your kit you also get um, these dimensionals if you need them and this kit did come with dimensionals. So, and I love to pop everything up. So I'm gonna put one at the bottom of the, of the anchor and one right here in the middle. And so that's going to go right there. Go ahead and stick that on. There we go. And put that just like that. And then at the bottom of this, we're going to stamp, you are my anchor. And this kit did come with Island Indigo, the Stampin' Spot, and I love Stampin' Spots. So you're gonna ink it up. And I always like to just try it one time and I already see that I didn't get ink at the top of that anchor. So I want to make sure I get it inked up well. And then I'm just going to put that right here at the bottom. And I'm going to press down, pull up, and there we go. I'm going to cut the top of this twine just a little bit. So it's not hanging off the card too much. And there we go. All right, one other thing, we're going to add a little gold heart. And these are already die cut. And we do have the glue dots. And I'm just gonna take, it's gonna be easier with my finger now. Take this glue dot hearts are kind of tiny. There we go. Going to put that right on the back of that heart and peel up. And then I'm going to put that heart right at the top in between those other two. And there we go. That gives it a little bling. And then this is one of the um, envelopes that comes with it and I thought this one would look really cute with that with the matching waves there all right so that's one of the cards 
The next one I'm going to do is this one right here. I've already folded this. And this one we're going to stamp a lighthouse. So I'm going to pull the lighthouse right off. Place it here. Get my block. And when you order paper pumpkin for the first time, you do get a block just like this. And this block is good for any of the images. All right, I'm going to ink this up. And I'm going to stamp it right on this um, die cut rectangle that um, is in your kit. So when it's a bigger image, I like to turn the ink over and stamp it, get it inked up this way. I feel like I have a little bit better control of where my ink is going. So I can get that good and inked up. I'm going to turn that over, line it up, press down, make sure I get it all pressed down, and right back up, and there we go. All right, we are also going to stamp a little tag for this one and change out. And this one is going to say you're a lifesaver. Now I'm making this, uh, these cards exactly the way the directions say, but you can always change it up and do something totally different. Or if you just want to change the words, you can do that. Um, there's lots of different things that you can do with your paper pumpkin kits. All right, I'm gonna line that up, press down, press up, there we go. Guess I'm not pressing up though, am I? I'm just lifting up. All right, we're gonna have, I've already cut this piece of um, twine, and I'm going to tie this right around the bottom of the anchor in a knot. Oops, sorry, got out of the camera there. Just going to tie it in a knot. Oops. There we go. Get those ends to go the way I want them to. All right, I'm also gonna put dimensionals on the back of this. I'm gonna put one in each corner. And these are those mini dimensionals, and I love the mini ones. They come in very handy when you have something a little bit smaller that you want to pop up. Make sure I have the card correct and I don't want to do it upside down. All right, so then I'm going to take this and line it up and then put it down just like that. And then this um, You Are a Lifesaver is going to go right across the top and I'm going to use the glue dots I like to use this piercing tool to pull up on the glue dots to make sure I get the glue and not just the top I'm going to go right across the middle here, put that down, cut these ends of my twine just a little bit, 
And there we go. There's just another card. Tie that a little bit tighter. There we go. And then the envelope that I thought that would look good with this one is this. It has some anchors on it there. So, so that would go with that one. All right. And then for the box. This box is really easy to put together. It's already um, cut out. It, all you have to do is um, fold over the score line. So it's cut out and scored for you. So we're just going to fold on all of these score lines. And I must have put my fingers in the ink. <laughs> all right. And this already has a, some tape on there, so all you have to do is pull that piece off. And you're gonna wrap that around. Just make sure you got it good and tight before you press that down. You don't want that box to be loose. Do the same thing, make sure those sides are all the way tucked in. All right, and then this is the slide you're about to slide your box in. It is also scored for you already, so just like that, and then that'll slide in there just like that. All right, so you could put your when you're all done, put a set of cards right inside. And then you have a nice little gift to give to someone. And the um, box can also be decorated with an anchor and a little tag that says for you. If you can see that. I thought that was really cute too. And there's plenty of twine in there for you to wrap twine around the box as well. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed seeing um, Paper Pumpkin. Those of you that um, have not subscribed to Paper Pumpkin yet, maybe this will give you a good idea of um, how easy doing a um, Paper Pumpkin kit is. And um, I just really love it to be able to take with me places when I'm sitting out at football practice or um, you know, something like that where I need something to do, but don't want to, can't take everything with me. So that having a kit that comes in a little box and it's all there ready for me to take is wonderful. Um, I did want to let you guys know that today is the last day to get the 50% off of um, Paper Pumpkin, of your first Paper Pumpkin. Sorry about that, but I wanted to share this with you. Um, so it's 50% off your first two months if you use the code SAVE50-0418. Um, so if you subscribe by today and you're a new subscriber, you will get your first two kits um, half off. Um, kits are normally $19.95 and that does include shipping. So your kit for um, May and then um, June will be $10 um, each. So it's like a buy one, get one free. If you're interested in try giving Paper Pumpkin a try, uh, please reach out to me. You can email me um, or message me on Facebook if you are seeing this there. Um, I'd love to help you get started. Thank you and have a blessed day.